and happy Wednesday. We're back with you today. I'm Rebecca. And I'm Anne. And we're the founders of It's Okay to Be Awesome, a mental wellness movement for kids and families. And today's topic for our mental wellness moment, or minute rather, is how to get out of overwhelm. And we want to introduce this just because overwhelm is kind of a scary thing. Sometimes you can be in this state of overwhelm, um, either a state of anxiety or a state of real lowness, and you may just not know why. So we've broken it down um, into three parts. Our life has three main pieces, and that's T, our thoughts, A, our actions, and R, our results. Also known as TAR. Mm -hmm. So... We have a saying, and it's okay to be awesome, and that's when you're stuck in the tar, mm -hmm. look at your R. Look at your result. Get specific with the result that's going on or that's happening in life, and only when you know what's going wrong can you make a change and and change the other two pieces to get the result you want. I'd like to give you an example to make it really clear. So let's say, for example, your result at the moment in your life is, I am exhausted. I'm always tired. You don't like your result. I understand. So we start with the R, we go back. What's the action that brought you to being tired? Perhaps you are putting too much on your plate. You're saying yes to everything that everything people are asking of you. And even though you don't want to, and then you're coming home late at night, you're watching TV just to get some time to yourself before you go to bed. And then you're tired again because you went to bed too late. Your thought might have been every time you wake up, oh gosh, I am tired. So you're just creating more and more and more of it. So with our technique of starting looking at your R, when you're stuck in the tar, look at your R, what's the R you would like to have? What about I am full of energy, I feel energized, I have energy for my life. So the action to get that would be perhaps take some things off your plate. Start making time for self-care, which could mean going to the gym or doing things for you or reading a book. Make time, make sure you're going to bed at a good time where you know you're going to get enough rest. And your thought, even though you, your thought would have to be, I feel energized, I'm full of energy. Whether or not you feel it, this is the thought you're going to tell yourself when you wake up in the morning or after lunch or anytime you need mm -hmm. to hear it. Because you're going to program yourself mm -hmm. to, to feel like I'm full of energy, I'm full of energy, I'm full of energy. It'll help you create your actions and create your result. Absolutely. So remember, when you're feeling stuck in the tar, look at your R and work backwards from there. If you have some awesome results you'd like to share with us, we're, we're all ears. We'd love to see how this can apply to your life. Send us a message or post on our Facebook page and have a lovely week. And we'll see you next Wednesday. Stay awesome. <laughs>